The uh, certification exam is extremely relevant in today's uh, environment of medical equipment servicing and repair. There are three of them. There's a certified biomedical equipment technologist, a certified radiology equipment specialist, and a certified laboratory equipment specialist. These three certifications are extremely important in today's medical equipment environment due to the fact that many states, as well as facilities, are increasingly becoming more aware of who is working on medical equipment. It's important and it does show that there is a certain amount of competency associated with uh, taking these examinations. Certification is a process that determines that you are qualified uh, on a particular day to pass a standardized test. As we know in this country, anybody anywhere can call themselves a BMET and can work on medical equipment since it's not uh, legislated or licensed in any of the 50 states. Having the CBET designation or CRES or CLES uh, means that you do have a, a defined body of knowledge. You, have, you, you know how to work on the equipment. You have the knowledge it takes to do that. Certification for the biomedical equipment technician is probably the single most important endeavor in which a biomedical equipment technician can undertake. BMET certification is extremely valuable because it sets you apart from the people who are not certified. The certification exam is not a very difficult exam if you're prepared. The examination uh, consists of questions from anatomy and physiology through uh, a technical component of troubleshooting and repair of medical equipment. Just think about this, it is a 150 question multiple choice examination. Multiple choice questions are by their very nature not that difficult even in a technical field like electronics or biomed. When I passed it in 1979, I did not know a single person who was also certified. I studied on my own and was able to pass it the very first time. And I don't think that that was because necessarily of my ability, but because it was such a well-defined body of knowledge and I applied myself and did some um, uh, structured studying beforehand. There are very many techniques for test taking that greatly improve your odds. In fact, there's many study opportunities uh, around the United States uh, where private organizations have developed uh, study groups and study programs, either through the internet or uh, through the uh, uh, conference calls. So uh, a person who makes themselves available to those types of uh, uh, educational opportunities as well as their day-to-day -day opportunities of throughout their work uh, day uh, shouldn't have too much of a problem with today's examination. As long as you're involved in the field and you're currently serving in the field, the certification exam should be something that you're already doing on a day-to-day -day basis. The questions are extremely relevant and extremely uh, appropriate for the position uh, that the BMET holds in today's healthcare environment. I would recommend uh, BMET certification uh, to anyone who's working in the field of biomedical equipment technology and uh, wish you well.